Mobile scenarios not only place significant demands on users' visual and mental resources, but users often need one of their hands to carry items, unlock doors, or otherwise interact with the environment, leaving then only one hand available to operate a device. Mobile devices themselves vary widely in their ability to support one-handed use. Those devices that take after traditional cell phones have a compact numeric keypad for input and so are generally easy to control and operate with a single hand. Devices with touch-sensitive screens can make it easier for users to do tasks that they are accustomed to performing on their desktop PC, like scheduling appointments, document editing, and web surfing. Similarly, those devices that include a QWERTY keyboard can offer users substantial improvements in speed and accuracy when writing email or text messaging on the go. However, such devices are generally larger and harder to manage with a single hand. Furthermore, their software designs usually assume that people will use the included stylus and so are not optimized for thumb use. Buttons, menus, and other interface objects can be too small to hit reliably with the thumb or even too far away given a particular grip on the device. We have developed thumb space to address these problems with using touchscreen-based devices with one hand. Users start by defining the sub-area of the screen that is within comfortable reach of the thumb. This region becomes the user's personalized thumb space. Our thumb space approach lets users interact with touchscreens as usual when objects are large enough or close enough to be hit with the thumb, but lets users maintain a single, stable grip when accessing objects that would otherwise be out of thumb reach. When the user wants to interact with objects that are out of thumb reach, she can bring up a miniature representation of the display within her thumb space. Touching an object in the display miniature shows a selection cursor over the associated object in the main display. To adjust the selection cursor, the user drags or rolls her thumb in the direction she wishes it to move. When the cursor is over the desired object, she lifts her thumb to perform the selection. By providing thumb space across all applications, designers of touchscreen interfaces can focus on providing the most effective layouts when two hands are available. Users then trigger thumb space only when necessary during one-handed operation.